Alright guys, what's up? Uh, today I'm digging in this uh, uh, area, colonial solar hole area, filled up in the woods here, but we're out in the woods. You can hear my dad out in the background. Got a um, faint signal on the AT Pro. It was bouncing from the 60s and 70s. I got myself a musket ball. So, that's really neat. Nice musket ball. I think I got another piece of melted lead. Um, I'll take that. Take it out anyways. Go. Not the piece of lead. But uh, yep. Musket ball. And not the piece of lead. Awesome. Let well, you know what else find. Alright, everyone. So we know locations now. And uh, you'll see in a bit up there. It's an old home site. And um, we're just hunting way out there in the cellar hole. And uh, didn't find much. I'll uh, just see. that? Um, we didn't find much. I found a musket ball, and uh, yeah, I found a few shotgun shells, and it's not much. Um, we're gonna head up to the truck now. I'm gonna get the gear, and uh, we're gonna start detecting it. This looks good. All right, guys. See you at the first hole. All right, guys. Here's the home site. See the old well. What do you got? Wait, hold it up. Hold it up. That's a horseshoe. Horseshoe hat. Horseshoe, throw it over here. Oh no, it looked a bit different from when you were holding it. Here, I'll put it in my pouch. Anyway, sorry about that. Um, I got a good signal. There's a screamer too. Really shallow. And there's the home. I mean the remains. Old well, I think that's what it was. There's a good dump back in there. People have just been throwing stuff in there for a while. Anyways. Got a nice Monica reed. It's really shallow, too. Which makes me think no one's ever been here before. That's a good sign. Alright guys, get back to you at the next. Alright guys, here's the home site. You can see the old well. What do you got? Wait, hold it up. Hold it up. That's a horseshoe. Horseshoe hat. Horseshoe, throw it over here. Oh no, it looked a bit different from when you were holding it. Here, I'll put it in my pouch. Anyway, sorry about that. Um, I got a good signal. There's a screamer too. Really shallow. And there's the home. I mean the remains. Old well, I think that's what it was. There's a good dump back in there. People have just been throwing stuff in there for a while. Anyways, got a nice Monica reed. It's really shallow too. Which makes me think no one's ever been here before. That's a good sign. Alright guys, get back to you at the next. Alright guys, about 10 minutes after I got to you with that uh, harmonica reed, there's dad digging over there. And uh, he's on a target. And I got a screamer signal. Um, wasn't that deep. And I saw this. I didn't I didn't brush, rub it off or anything, but uh, let's go ahead and see. It looks like it has got some detail under there, so let's see what we got. There we go. Huh. really weird. Give me a second, I'll get it cleaned up better um, for you and uh, let you know what I got. Alright, so I got it cleaned off a bit better. I'm not sure what it is. Looks like it's got like a snake pattern on there or something. But um, it definitely held something at one time, opened and closed. No, you're kidding. Oh my goodness, you're joking. It's broken. Where? Is that part of an arrowhead? So they've been flaked and worked and hand worked. No, it's a um piece of coal. Oh. Yeah, I know. I'm sitting right on top. I thought it was an arrowhead. Uh you had me really stall oh my goodness. Stop my heart for a second. <laughs> That's neat though. Anyways, um I got it cleaned up a bit better. So uh there it is. Held something at one time, got crushed now, so we'll find out later though. Alright guys. See you the next. Just dug this pocket watch gear here. Really neat. Dug it uh right over there back um where my detector is. Dad's digging a signal. Give you a little look on what's um what what it here. We think when the house came down, 
um, they just pushed all the stones and bricks up against this just into a big pile. This could have been the old well here, so it's stacked like that. But you can see how this was off the house. It's a slate. Horseshoe. Horseshoe half, really? I see it. Maybe. Yep, for sure. Nah, that's a cool find. See? Nails and horseshoes. I'm going to cook you the nail king and the horseshoe. <laughs> oh, man. All right, guys. I'll go back to you. All right, guys. Dad just got a coin. This could be an Indian head. This home is old. Where is it? Okay. Ready? Yeah. I think it is a coin. Oh, you think it is? Okay. You think you saw it? I hear you saw it. Oh, no. Turn the pinpointer on. It is on. Let me redo it. Yeah. Oh, I see it. It's right there. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. There you go. Oh, it's Turn coins. your pinpointer on. It's a coin. Yeah. Oh, don't be a Lincoln. No, it's not. It's. No. What is it? It's a penny. Here, let me see it out. Oh, it is. It's a wheat. It's wheat. a weedy. Wheat penny. Shoot, what's the date? I was hoping it was an Indian or something. 56, no, 36. Oh my god. That's so cool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I know, I thought you were going to have an Indian or something. Oh my god, I know. Hey, you got the first coin of the whole day. Woohoo. So, yeah. Penny. <laughs> All right. That's still neat. Hey, there's silver on here, I can tell. Alright, we'll get back to you guys. Alright guys, dad, dad just got a good signal here. It was, it was a nice high signal. And uh, it's right there. It's, it looks like it's going to be a buckle. Why don't you pull it out, dad? Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Wow. Yeah, just missing the... Let's see it. Gosh, it's a beauty. I'm jealous. <laughs> that's a nice one. Looks like it was an old, old horse tack buckle for sure. Sling buckle or something. All right, get back to you. All right, guys, just dug this nice pewter spoon fragment, I should say. Put some uh, really nice, nice colonial one. Pretty sure early 1800s. Actually, I dinged it to here because it was under some roots, but still like it. It's nice. It's pewter. Oh, wow, look at that. Didn't even notice that now until cleaning up. It's got a nice design on them back right here all right that's cool i'll see you guys at the next all right guys i just dug this uh really nice brooch at a new property here very nice property huge one but that's really cool i love the colors of it so let you know what else is fine all right guys just got a nice spoon so let me get you out here in the light looks like it was definitely silver plated at one time very cool spoon can't see the maker's mark yet, but uh, you'll see it in the wrap up. All right, guys, I'll see you at the next. All right, guys, I'm gonna do a wrap up for uh, today's hunt. It was a nice one. Uh, I didn't find too too much. It was more of a relic day though, but um, I'm still happy with the find. So, first start out with this. Uh, old uh, looks like old clock uh, clock uh, piece. It's pretty cool. Um, found. Melted piece of lead. Looks actually like a bullet smashed and maybe hit something. Old pistol bullet. Pretty neat. Uh, what else we got here? Oh, nice little pocket watch. I love this green patina on this pocket watch piece. And a beautiful brooch. Look at the colors on this. Very happy with this find. I think it's a brooch. I'm really not sure. It looks like it would hit hook on something right there, but whatever it is, really like it. Love the colors. Uh, I got a musket ball. Pretty cool. A uh, bunch of harmonica reed pieces. Nice old spoon that was silver plated at one time. It's pretty neat. Let me get you down in here. You can see the maker's mark. That's the wrong way.
plate, silver she filled or something. Silver plate. Then I found this really neat piece, which I'm not sure about what it is yet. I'm still deciding, um, I mean, identifying it. But whatever it is, I think it's really cool. thought it was a powder flask. Then I thought it was a scabbard, but I have no clue. Whatever it is, I really like it. It's really cool. And then a late 1700s, early 1800s uh, spoon fragment. I like the design there. I accidentally put two scratches in it. <laughs> but, uh, really f nice find, nonetheless. So, I have to get better at that. Stop scratching my finds. So, uh, yeah, it was a nice hunt. I uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, good luck and happy hunting.